phenol is described by the Agency for Toxic Substances and Disease Registry as both a manufactured chemical and a natural substance that is solid when pure, but the commercial product is typically a liquid. Due to its commercial importance, millions of tons of it are produced each year across the globe. The National Institute for Occupational Safety and Health reports that workers may be harmed from exposure to phenol with the level of harm depending upon the dose, duration, and work being done. Routes of exposure include inhalation, oral, and dermal. Exposure to phenol may cause irritation to the skin, eyes, nose, throat, and nervous system. Some symptoms of exposure to phenol are weight loss, weakness, exhaustion, muscle aches, and pain. Severe exposure can cause liver and or kidney damage, skin burns, tremor, convulsions, and twitching. Phenol is used in many industries. NIOSH states that it is used for medicine as a slimicide, antiseptic, and disinfectant, and to manufacture a number of products. Some examples of workers at risk of being exposed include workers in the petroleum industry, workers in plants where nylon is manufactured, workers in plants that manufacture epoxy resins, and workers in plants that manufacture herbicides. There are published workplace exposure limits meant to protect all workers. For the general population, the Agency for Toxic Substances and Disease Registry lists the following sources of exposure. These are just a few things to know about phenol and potential exposure risks. To learn more about this or other industrial hygiene, air quality, environmental health, or safety issues, please visit the websites shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.